easiest attempted murder investigation ever. I'm an officer in a large metropolitan police agency, on a unit I've called tactical patrol for the purposes of posting here. We typically aren't responding to general patrol calls, we're self-assigning to serious-slash-violent sounding calls, doing our own gun-slash-stolen car investigations, executing warrants, that sort of thing. Most of us have SWAT backgrounds, many of us are EMTs, quite a few of us are also detectives. It's probably 4 a.m., we're just cruising around the side streets in the ghetto per usual. My partner is Junior who I've mentioned before. Dark car with its headlights off traveling at a very high rate of speed and opposing side of traffic almost hits us head on. We don't usually do traffic stops, but you literally almost hit an unmarked unit doing high key egregious shit, so we're going to stop you. Stop them, they pull over immediately without hesitation, headlights turn on. We run the plate which was clean, occupants appeared to be a young couple, didn't really seem high risk. We were just going to cite them and tell them to stop driving like assholes in a dark car at 4 a.m. with their headlights off. Partner makes contact, I hang back. After talking a bit his gun comes out, he's ordering the occupants out. What the fuck? Anyway we treat it now as a felony stop, call back up, both occupants ordered out at gunpoint. I ask him what the fuck happened? Turns out, upon making contact the suspect asked how we got them so fast. Suspect then proceeded to admit to my partner that they just got done robbing a place, but the occupant woke up so they shot him, literally minutes prior. That's what prompted them to be ordered out. They then started yelling that we were being racist, literally immediately after they almost wrecked into us then confessed to murder on the traffic stop. AK-74 in the trunk. They pretty much pointed out exactly what house they robbed. We ended up checking it. There was a semi-conscious male occupant with several gunshot wounds. Was transported by EMS to the hospital. Lived, so they got hit with attempt murder and armed robbery home invasion.